which I ordered a new mic, not for, really for ASMR purposes, but I also like to stream video games and record video games and add them to YouTube. So I uh, ordered a new mic, and it said that, or, yeah, a mic, <laughs> and it said it was delivered here, but I never got it. So I'll, I'll have to contact Amazon or just wait over the weekend and call them on Monday or something. But I have two items for you. So I'll start with the smaller one. It came in standard postal service envelope. I black, blacked out my uh, address, black, blackout style, for obvious reasons. Oh yeah. I got this knife at Walmart for like four dollars. It's awesome. And today I got my Assassin's Creed Syndicate. I know this game's been out for a year or two, but I never got around to playing it. And I heard mixed things on it. But I heard it was better than Unity, which Unity really sucked to be honest. And it was on sale on Amazon for $14. So I figured why not. So I heard this is the most recent Assassin's Creed game because I think it takes place in uh, yeah, 1868. That's pretty cool. They did get rid of the multiplayer, which is okay. I didn't really play much of the online anyway. But I loved how uh, in uh, Brotherhood they had the Assassin Hunt, I think it was called, where it was you and eight play and eight other people and you had to hunt somebody down and while you were trying to get them someone else is trying to hunt to get you so I'll just open this got the seal stuck on my thumb season pass you get Jack the Reaper and um looks like a revolver prototype of some sort I wasn't cool enough to get the season pass but I left two years without it I'll be fine come on there we go so yeah I'm excited to play this over the weekend and now my second item I've already opened just to inspect to make sure everything was okay <coughs> <clears throat> Just to make sure that it wasn't damaged. Yeah, it's a little bit bigger. I got this one off of eBay. Sorry if that's a little too loud. And you got your brown paper for stocking. Bubble wrap. You don't not pop bubble wrap when you are giving bubble wrap. You just have to. Alright, and now, this is something I've always wanted since I was probably in the 7th or 8th grade. And I finally bought it nine years later. Chief element. <laughs> it's uh, part of the Halo 3 Legendary Edition where you got the helmet. Um, I bought it. It didn't have the stand for it, which I was okay with that because it can stand on its own. Um, I think when it came out, it was like $200 or $250, which is pretty standard for the Legendary Edition. But I was you know, 13 years old. I didn't really have that money laying around. So I got this on eBay. I actually got it for 40 bucks, and the seller paid for that due date shipping too. And it's really, really nice. There's like no marks or scrapes. There's a couple of these little white things, but that's okay. It's really, really nice. Halo is my favorite gaming franchise. I have invested probably 30 days on Halo 3 alone. That's my favorite Halo of all time. But it's the game that got me into competitive online gaming. So. I owe it a lot, <laughs> and uh, my girlfriend didn't know that I ordered this until I got it, so she couldn't really say no. <laughs> She's not really into these gaming things, but uh, yeah, I think it's really cool. I love the fight. 
wiser. I like the original Halo helmet versus Sick Neil 4 and 5, where 343 redesigned his helmet. So, thank you guys for watching. I'm sorry this was a short video. I just thought it would be a nice video until my next one. Uh, thank you for watching, and if you have any suggestions, please leave them in the comments below. Thank you, and have an amazing weekend.